So the Mandalorian Season 3 is finally completed and I made a video already about why the Mandalorian Season 3 is not up to the mark compared to the previous two seasons. And well, after watching the season finale, my thoughts kinda changed but not that much. The first thing I'd say, it was awesome seeing Bo-Katan wielding the Dark Saber and leading Mando Troopers jetpacking in and fighting the Moff Gideon Mando Troopers. That was awesome. Clone Wars had a lot of stuff like that but seeing that on a live action has a different feeling. It was amazing. And the final fight with Moff Gideon was also done pretty well. And spoiler alert, the Dark Saber got destroyed. And in the season 3 we have seen every good thing is followed up by a shit ton of bad things. So that does happen in the season finale. The whole season was building up as Bo-Katan's season but she didn't get the final victory against Moff Gideon. It was Axel with his Star Destroyer. And and that was a weird choice. And as of right now, we have seen that that cloning plotline of cloning Palpatine was thrown out of the picture and we have a cloning self with Gideon now. Now I have heard some theories about why Moff Gideon doesn't have a mustache in this season cause that's a clone. The real Moff Gideon is still alive. It does have a wit to it so I think that is going to happen in season 4. The biggest issue of this season was a lack of focus and the useless scenes where Mandos are fighting dinosaurs. Like those wasted the screen time and led to nothing. If it was like Mandos are learning to train dinosaurs and in the final battle they would ride on dinosaurs like stuff that would be cool but that didn't happen then we have the mythosaur introduced and kind of forgotten until the very last scene then we had jack black and lizzo being jack black and lizzo and we have doc brown who drove his delorean into the mandalorian and his story was just simping for dooku and nothing much. We also had the scene where the Mandalorians got a place to live in Navarro and the Mandalorians have been underground and in hiding and as soon as they got a good place to stay, they left that place. It was done in such a rush. This season after wasting a lot of time on useless stuff had the season finale being so rushed that there is a scene where Mandos went into the underground cave to be safe for a while and for a while is not even two minutes. Their backup arrives and they leave that place. Now yes, I know this video at times might feel a bit too nitpicky because I am because I like Star Wars and I also know that no one from Lucasfilm would watch my video like I hardly get 10 20 views so why am I making this video just out of love for Star Wars so that's all I got for today's video and hope you enjoyed my video and if you did hit the like button don't hit the dislike because no one's gonna see that and hopefully meet you in the future